go ask me something. What? What is the reason? Ooh, sorry, I'm not trying to kill him. I swear. That's the shank part. <laughs> <laughs> what developed this relationship with food? Um, honestly, um, damn, no, this is crazy because this is crazy. I didn't think I was gonna get to this, but um, for somebody asking me questions, mm -hmm. but. I, you know, we eat food. We're, we're humans. We like to eat. We gotta, we gotta stay alive. Yeah. But, um, but um, you know, I um, I was in prison, and we had to come. Yo, out with, big ups to you, cause prison is not for everybody. Prison, ain't for, prison wasn't. First for of all, you. fuck that shit. <laughs> prison wasn't for me. <laughs> prison wasn't for me. No thanks. But I had to find my way. You know what I mean? I had to find um a way to get through it. I had to find a way to survive. And um, the number one way to survive, well, it's number two way to survive. Um, first, you gotta, you know, you gotta, um, you gotta stay safe. You gotta find mm -hmm. your way to stay safe, whether it be mm -hmm. fighting or whether it be to hide. Um, I wasn't gonna be a person who hid, and I do need to eat. So that's the second way. But shout to the one who do, because that's not an easy decision to make either. Yeah. Yeah. If, if you can hide, then hide your ass off. <laughs> be the best. <laughs> There's a lot of hide places. Be to the hide. best. <laughs> but um, with, with, but they would give us slop in the um, mess hall, and I didn't like the slop. The food was gross. It was trash. And I, I had a lot of friends who worked inside of the mess hall who, um, who they, they took pride in what they made. And it was more so like you stir in a big pot, or mm -hmm. you know what I mean. Um, it's certain, some days we had like baked chicken or fried fish or whatever like that. It's like you're not really putting a lot of. They thought they were putting a lot of love into it, but I would say, hey, listen, if I can get somebody to bring me back some raw chicken to the unit, and they, and and I can season it up myself, and I cooked everything in the microwave. Mm -hmm. Everything was in the microwave. Wow. Everything. Got cooked in the microwave. So anything Talent. you see, anything, anything that you see in this cookbook right here, right, was, was in, a in a microwave. In a microwave, and it, and um, aside from the hooch, because there's a chapter <laughs> on hooch, but um, I cooked everything in a microwave, and I was like, you know what? It's not a matter of not having the ingredients; it's just a matter of how it's cooked. So everybody can have the same ingredients as I do in my refrigerator, but if you don't know what to do with it, then you know what good is the food. So I decided to come up with this cookbook and I said, you know what, we all use a fork, we all use a, um, you know, a spoon to eat with and anything, but you know what, Not we everybody. use a shank. And, yeah. and the shank is what got me through it. So yeah. I was like, the shank is a representation of where I come from and the fork and spoon is the food. So that's why I named the fork, spoon, and shank. So I was just trying to get a little crazy. You know, so I put a little, I put a bunch of stories in there. I mean, how, just as much you know, as important as a spoon and the fork is, the shank is really the connection, the connection. to the food yeah. and so your I decided food. to put some stories in there and um, about um, what happened and how I obtained the ingredients. So it was like, it wasn't just a, um, I said, I need an onion, pepper, and tomato. Yeah. It was like. So it was it. really like in Goodfellas when he was like, you know, oh, they live like this, whatever. Oh, but deep. with us, we had our own quarters and they was bringing in meats and he was slicing up the garlic real, real thin where yes, it liquefied so. in the pan. Yes. If I told you how I, how I sliced garlic, you would cry. You would be like, are you serious? Do you use a razor? Because no. he used a razor. No. You, like, you know what I used to slice my garlic with? I took a can top, a tuna fish can top. And I would sharpen it in between the grout on the um and the tiles in the bathroom and make it really sharp. And I would slice my garlic. No fucking with a can with a um, tuna fish can. Top. Tuna fish can top. Yeah, yeah. And I used it all the time. So I was like, hey, get the can top, get the knife. As the finest yeah, knife. The finest knife. Yeah. A chef's knife. Yeah, chef's knife. That's what you slice. I can't. Can. Yeah. So when you don't have a knife, you got to cook tuna. And it doubles as a shank, cause you know, um, not so much like a, a stabbing shank, but a shank that you can. Can I ask you a question? 